Bitcoin has finally halved April 20th, 2024. We're going to have this date ingrained in our brains for the rest of time now. And we can move on and talk about some narratives that have seen a massive pullback over the last few weeks leading up to the Bitcoin halving. And as I've said time and time again, I do believe we're going to see a massive run up on altcoins. And today we're taking a look at AI altcoins. So we're going to talk about three that I believe have seen a massive correction and that may be getting ready for the next leg up we're going to give you those details but before we do if you are new to the channel make sure you subscribe and smash the like button of course check out the vip discord that we have you're going to get access to a private sales to pre-sales all of my buys and plays that I am doing. And so far, I think we've had this Discord for about two weeks and we have seen over five, six deals come our way and we keep on bringing more and more. So if you're interested in that, have a look. And we also still have the free version of our Discord. So if we take a look at the general sentiment on AI coins over the last week, going on to coin market cap, we can see that the majority of of AI coins have seen a major pullback in their price over last week, even over the last two weeks. And now is the time you want to be looking at specific ones. And just to give you guys a few examples here, we have a node AI down about 20%. We have AIT down about 18%. We have a bit tensor down 16%, Viat 15%. Game GPT 15%, PAL AI, you get the gist. Everything is down from its recent highs. And this is again one of the opportunities that we are faced with with the Bitcoin having now in the future, we can talk about what is going to potentially happen to Bitcoin as well as our altcoins. So if we quickly take a look at the Bitcoin chart, I am recording this just a few hours before the Bitcoin having, but as we stand right now, we are sitting right around at 64,000 for Bitcoin. We've obviously all seen the news about the war with Israel and Iran and all of that. I'm not getting into all of those politics, but we've seen the impacts that that has had on a cryptocurrency on bitcoin we've seen dips all the way down to 59,000, but i do believe we are going to stay the course and what i mean by that is after this having i do believe we are going to continue consolidating in and around this range for bitcoin and at some point in time within the next few months as we get that supply shock from a Bitcoin having halved and we get people wanting more and more Bitcoin, I do believe we are going to see a pump on a Bitcoin. And this is kind of my time frame, you know, from April to let's say July of 2024, a few months go by, we're going to see this. And then I do believe we are going to get an uptrend on Bitcoin. Not too sure how far it's going to go, but I do believe we are going to see an uptrend on Bitcoin. Now, if we take a look at what's going to happen with our altcoins, we can have a look at the total three market cap. I've showed this chart to you guys time and time again. And as we have saw a massive pullback over the last week or so, we were sitting around $780 billion worth of market cap. And now we're at $634 billion. So we lost about $140 billion worth of altcoins market cap. I do think we're going to come back in and around this range, probably consolidate there for a few months as well. And when we see Bitcoin push, well, as you can imagine, altcoins are going to ultimately follow Bitcoin. And I still am a strong believer that we are going to see a new all-time high market cap for altcoins in the peak of this bull market. So that is obviously my thesis. I could be wrong, but we are going to have to wait and see because no one has a crystal ball and no one can make these predictions with certainty. So what we can do is speculate based on historical data and that's what we've done here. Now, the first project I wanna talk about today is Sonorous, ticker SNS. I've talked about this one several times in other videos, but the reason I want to bring it up today is because of what's happened in the recent months with Sonorous. And if you're not familiar with 
method? Well, we are talking about AI powered music. They've recently introduced this AI feature where people are actually able to generate a song via a prompt. So this is what they call their sonorous beat AI. And as we can see here, we have people in their discord that are essentially able to type in a certain prompt. And then the AI bot within a sonorous's platform is going to publish a song for you. And then you can actually download that song. You can utilize it and it is copyright free. So it's very interesting. This is their new addition to their ecosystem because generally speaking a sonorous is a decentralized music platform where people can upload music where people can also vote on their favorite music and so on and so forth it is available on ios as well as android so we are talking about you know a music ecosystem that is essentially decentralizing the way we think of music so that's Sonorous in a nutshell, and we also made a full video going into the details of the tokenomics and all of that. So if you want to have a listen to it, there is going to be a link at the top of your screen here. But why I want to go back to Sonorous and talk about it today is because of what we've seen in the past. And if I just show you their chart, we can see that when they announced this AI integration within their project, the price of Sonorous went from three cents to about 30 cents in the matter of a full week. So in the matter of about seven days or so, it did a 10X. And as we can see now over the last few weeks, as we have seen the AI narrative cool down, as we have seen, you know, prices go back to reality, we're back with Sonorous right around 10 cents. And if we just take a look at the last month, we did have, you know, a low right around eight cents, even seven and a half cents at one point. And right now, we are hovering right around 10 cents. So this is why I want to bring Sonorous to your attention because the team is continuing to develop this AI product and now they've also introduced a way for people to actually utilize this product by buying it with the SNS token. So this is available to anyone and now it has even a better use case for the SNS token. Now, of course, I am running one of these nodes as well. So as you can see here, I have two nodes and I have gained about 11,000 Sonorous with this. I'm earning about 30 tokens per day from these two nodes. And that comes up to about $3 per day. It sounds like absolute peanuts right now. But again, thinking that Sonorous, let's say it goes back to 30 cents. Well, we're looking at about $10 versus, you know, $3. So ultimately, this is going to fluctuate as the price of the SNS token fluctuates. But I am keeping my node running and I am just earning more and more Sonorous. They do also have a staking available if you are looking to stake your Sonorous. They still have about $1.1 million in a TVL staked in this protocol. And you are still able to buy nodes. I'll leave my referral link down below if you're interested in this. But ultimately, Sonorous is one of those platforms and projects, in my opinion, that cater to both two narratives. We have the AI narrative, and we also have the music narrative. And we can talk about, you know, like gala music and all of those other protocols that are decentralizing the way we think of music. So this one, again, AI music, keep it on your watch list. It is down heavily from their all-time highs. So have a look at it and keep monitoring it. Now, moving on to project number two, we are seeing Viat. This one here has had some pretty good news over the last few weeks. And if we take a look at its price chart, I am in my Discord telling you guys what I bought. I believe I bought this back in November or December around 10 cents. It's now around 22 cents. It went all the way to about 40 cents. Again, have a look at that Discord that is within the VIP section where you can see all of my buys and sells. But again, for Viya, we did see a massive explosion from about 12 cents all the way to about 40 cents in the matter of a few weeks. And now we are seeing again a cool off in the AI space. Now, the reason I'm bringing buy it to your attention, and for those of you who don't know, if we just go visit their website real quick, we are talking about artificial intelligence assistance. 
And we are talking about three different use cases here. We have an AI legal assistant, an AI crypto protection broker, an aggregator, as well as an AI merchant. But if we take a look at their recent announcement, this was back on April 9th, and we can see that they have officially revealed their AI legal assistant V2. So they've made a new version of this bot or assistant and now this literally launched just a few days ago they're running a few campaigns but this is going to be in beta testing so again we are seeing that the team behind buy it continues to build on its products and sitting right now at a very low market cap of 70 million so again another one to watch not many people are really talking about it and we can see that you know back in the day in october this thing was at a 13 million dollar market cap even back in february of 2024 we were around 45 million so right now we did peak around 125 million dollars worth of market cap and again as ai has cooled off we're seeing that that buy it is roughly around 70 million so keep an eye out on this one i have personally invested in it as well i do think that this company is going to catch some people off guard because again not too many people are talking about it now i'm sure everyone has heard of delizium agi because back in the beginning of march this one here was all over social media it literally went from about five cents all the way to 65 70 cents in the matter of a few weeks and we can see here on march 9th we had about 65 cents per token and if we just take a look at the interest on you know google trends what were people searching well before the massive explosion on this token there was no interest in delizium and as we can see on march 9th well we can see a hundred percent interest on delizium and this coincides directly with this massive price appreciation now what I do want you guys to realize here is we've seen a massive decline, you know, in the last few weeks from 65 cents now to 27 cents. And again, look at the interest. It's completely gone because the price of the underlying token isn't doing anything. But if you are a believer of the AI narrative and you believe in what Delizium is building, and let me remind you what the market cap was for Delizium during this, you know, massive run, it was right around 400 million. Well, you should probably still be bullish on Delizium even more nowadays because they've continued to develop their products. And the, the one I want to talk about today is Lucy, which is essentially their AI assistant. And as we can see here, they have three steps for it. Step one is already done. So again, check mark, they've completed a, you know, product for everybody to use. And we can see here, this is with everything to do with Web3 users, with helping them with crypto workflows. So you can set alarms via Lucy. You can monitor different trends and prices of coins and so on and so forth. Now what they're building, and again, this is why it is one of the projects that I would suggest you continue following is they're going to continue increasing the knowledge behind this bot. So you're going to be able to tell Lucy what to do with your money. Let's say you want to buy AGI with $100. You can do that. Let's say you want to swap USDC into another, you know, token, whatever token that may be, Sonorous, you know, Viet or whichever one you're going to be able to use Lucy to do it. Now, this is very, very interesting. And on top of that, they're going to be enabling a network of autonomous agents all within, you know, the blockchain. So this is going to allow people to essentially have an operating system within Lucy to interact with different smart contracts. And I do believe, I'm not too sure of the timeline here, but I do believe this is going to be a project to watch out for as they are continuing to evolve within the AI space. And for those who don't know, Delizium also has a partnership with Microsoft as well as Google Cloud. So of course, this one here is is one to keep on your watch list with it being down a whole lot from its recent hype i do want to stress that i believe ai is going to continue being you know adopted worldwide and i do believe we're going to have another run-up on ai coins 
and Delizium seeing a good pullback right now. We can also see that, you know, it is relatively back in this consolidation phase prior to the run up from 25 cents all the way to 65 cents. So ultimately, Delizium is at an interesting level for me to continue looking at it and continue monitoring it. So do keep an eye out on their social, continue watching this project because if it runs once again, I do see the interest. It's going to peak again. People are going to FOMO into this and you want to get in prior to FOMO and prior to people talking about a project. So again, this is not financial advice. I'm just bringing back some of the coins that have seen a lot of strength in the last few months. We are now seeing them back towards, you know, more normal levels. But again, as we do expect another run on AI coins, I would expect these three coins to do well. But again, it's not financial advice and I could be wrong. So with all of that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know your thoughts on these three coins. Let me know your thoughts on other AI coins. There are many out there. We can talk about so many different ones, but I wanted to focus on these three today as they're not talked about as much and they are still relatively low market caps compared to the other big ones. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments comment section below if you did enjoy smash the like button check out the free discord as well as our vip group and with that said i'll catch you guys in my next video peace